Hey, what is going on everyone? This is iReviews back with another video and today we're talking about the latest update to iOS 15, iOS 15.4.1. So we recently got iOS 15.4 and it's a great update, it has amazing new features, but there was a problem. A lot of people were reporting that the battery on their iPhone was draining a lot. And now Apple has released a new update which actually we expected to be released, iOS 15.4.1 which actually will fix this problem. But of course, it has some new changes as well. So let's go ahead, take a look at this update and see what's new with iOS 15.4.1. And of course, should you update or not? Now, as with every other update, I always suggest users to actually wait for a few days until we get the reports from the public on the update, whether it's good or not. But when it's a small update like this, that it tends to actually just fix a few problems, then I suggest you go ahead and update immediately. And one of those updates is iOS 15.4.1. So going to settings here, general software update, here we will have now the update for iOS 15.4.1. So the size is not that big, it's around 300 megabytes right here on the iPhone 12 Pro Max. Of course, this will always be different on different devices. So when you install this update, don't expect to have any new features. It only has fixes. So if we tap right here on learn more, we have the fixes and the first of them is the battery drain issue. So this update includes the following bug fixes for your iPhone, it says. So it's battery may drain more quickly than expected after updating to iOS 15.4. That has been fixed with this update. Hopefully it will have great battery life. And then we have devices might become unresponsive while navigating text or displaying an alert. Didn't have that problem, but it looks like users have had that problem and now it's fixed. And the last one, made for iPhone hearing devices might lose connectivity with some third party apps. So these are the three main bugs that this update will fix. Again, the battery drain issue, which has impacted a lot of users being the main one. So talking about this update, should you update or not? Of course you should. I suggest every user that has already updated to iOS 15.4 to go ahead and update to iOS 15.4.1 as soon as possible. And even if you haven't updated to iOS 15.4 because you have heard about the news that this update is actually draining the battery on iPhones, now I suggest you go ahead and update your device to iOS 15.4.1 if you're on iOS 15.3 or 15.3.1. So what about the next updates for iOS 15? So we're waiting actually for iOS 15.5 beta that didn't get released this week. We waited since two weeks for that beta to be released. It looks like Apple will actually just postpone this update and just release smaller updates, but I believe it should happen during April. Most likely even next week, we should see the first beta of iOS 15.5 getting released to the devs and then the public testers, of course, a few days later. But now that Apple has actually released this fix for the battery drain with iOS 15.4.1, I believe that there won't be any issues going ahead and releasing the new iOS 15.5 beta one, which again, I don't expect it to have a lot of new features, only like like polishing of iOS and of course bug fixes, improvements and all that. So I expect it to happen somewhere around maybe April the 5th or 6th. Those are the two dates that Apple might release iOS 15.5 beta one to the devs. So that's basically it for this video guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like on this video and of course subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'll see you on the next one.